clean energy is the wave of the future, and measures are being taken to reduce the human footprints on our environment. Clever human-powered inventions are on the horizon. These innovative devices use people's energy to travel further and faster, keeping people in shape and maybe even having some fun in the process. Here are 5 Unbelievable Human-Powered Machines If you are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe to get similar content every week. Number 5. Katanga If you're driving down the highway and spot a small, aerodynamic vehicle that looks a lot like a speeding bullet, it just may be the Wa Velomobile. <laughs> what? Built in Europe by Frederick van de Waal, the Wa is a bicycle, race car hybrid that pedals like a bike but can reach speeds of up to 50 km per hour and has 33% less drag than a bicycle. The concept was developed to provide protection in speed and bike travel. The sportive tank steering system, the low point of gravity, wide front wheel track and stiff suspension give this sporty little vehicle excellent handling and maneuverability. The separate brake levers activate drum brakes that give the Velomobile powerful stopping capabilities. The closable hood keeps bikers protected from weather and it has features to keep it safe in traffic. This human-powered bike can keep you dry on your way to work, has room for a bag of groceries and will keep you in great shape. Number 4. Human-Powered Elevator If you have a fear of getting trapped in an elevator or hate climbing stairs, there is a human-powered alternative in the works. Robout Freeling Lab, located in the Netherlands, is developing the vertical walking system. This invention uses an upright rail that incorporates a gripping system and pulleys. Users simply sit in a chair and use their arms to pull two ropes. This moves the seat upwards while the legs propel the device. While this may seem like a lot of work, it actually moves between the floors in a building using only 10% of the effort needed to climb stairs. Powered by just your arms and legs, this energy-efficient system will make the most use out of space in crowded buildings as it takes up much less room than staircases and elevators. If you hate waiting for a crowded elevator or fighting the bottlenecks of staircases, the vertical walking system is being designed to offer new possibilities for traveling vertically. Number 3. Lopafit What do you get when you cross a treadmill, a scooter, and a bike? The Lopafit electric walking bike has wheels like a bike, a track like a treadmill, and works like an e-bike. The walking motion powers a drive chain that spins a gear. With the help of a battery, an electric motor assists the 2.3 meter long treadmill powered bike. You get great walking exercise, but travel at the speed of a bike. Pause or catch your breath by simply standing still to coast, and use the handbrakes to come to a stop. The idea of the walking bike came from the Dutch founder Bruin Bergmeter who wanted to be able to use a treadmill with the freedom of being outdoors. The three-speed Shimano Nexus transmission gives the Lopafit speed and control. It can reach speeds around 25 km per hour and has a 55 km range. The LED lights front and rear make this bike highly visible, and it even comes with a built-in luggage rack. Treadmill your way through the countryside, or even use a treadmill to get to work. Number 2. Schwieb an ideal invention for getting to work would be a pneumatic tube, like they have at banks for depositing checks. Until humans can be sucked through tubes for transportation, New Zealand has crossed a bicycle with a monorail and has developed the Schwieb, which might be the next best thing. The Schwieb uses people power and is a transit system that uses a cycle to move passengers along a rail seated in a tube. The idea is to transport people to places in a city through an elevated network of interconnected monorails. This aerodynamic cycle tube can reach speeds of 90 kpm, breaking all bicycle speed records. No tires mean less resistance and riders have less effort to reach greater speeds. This vehicle is weather resistant, won't derail while texting and riding, and commuters will never have to stop for traffic lights. Right now the Schwieb is just a ride at a New Zealand amusement park, but the developers are hoping it will someday revolutionize the daily commute. Number 1. Scubster. There are now bikes in the air which travel in tubes, bikes that look like cars, and bikes that travel on the surface of the water. Who would have thought someone would invent a bike in a sub that travels underwater? The Subster, built by the French designer Min Loctrong and Stéphane Roussin, created the first pedal-powered submarine. 
The system was built with a customized gear mechanism and drive belt from Strida and works much like a bike. Drivers will pump away at the pedals and the Subster will turn and dive using blades located on each side. The controls inside the compartment can guide the sub up, down or turn to the left or right. The driver controls the angle of incidence and can maneuver the sub forward or even backward. It reaches speeds of around 6 miles per hour. However, the pilot does have to wear scuba gear. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like and hit that subscribe button so that you won't miss any of our future videos.